Newly single after an 8 year relationship, online dating seems worse than before. Well that's true but let's see what he has to say. I'm 36 year old male, got a great job, I hit the gym and look good, I dress up casual but nice, I have no debt, got a Toyota Tacoma 4x4, alright, alright. I live in a house but my father owns it, not so good, and I have a roommate to split the bills with, and I got the master bedroom just 10 minutes from downtown. I seem to have everything I need and that most women would flock to my way, no problem. But it's been dry as a desert for me and the games and ghosting are non-stop. I've been single for about 3 months but in this time I've only dated with a girl for about a couple weeks I felt like she was below my standards. She blew me off the day after she slept over my place for the second time. Each other woman online ignores me and the ones that do message me are ugly as hell. Well that's not very nice. I feel like American women are truly tainted and have unrealistic expectations. They just seem psychotic and arrogant. Is it the birth control and the hormones they're pumped with? I'm not a doctor, but I, I, it could be a you problem. I don't think every woman has a problem with their hormones and birth control. I think it might be a you problem, my man. Is it social media or 5G cell phone towers making them like this? So I hate social media. I hate it very much. It makes people weird and stuff like that. I will agree with that. But I don't think it's the 5G cell phone towers making it so you get no pussy. I don't think that's the real reason. I, I don't think that's why you're getting no pussy. Like, as someone who doesn't pull women, as the comment section likes to point out that I'm terrible with women, like, I don't blame 5G cell phone towers. I know it's a me thing. Regardless of what it is, there's a huge problem with American women. They would rather be alone than not have a man in the top 5%. I would like to have a beautiful woman, but she doesn't have to be drop dead gorgeous. I don't even care for makeup. If she's a little bit chubby, that's fine with me. She doesn't even have to dress up too nice because I think that a simple woman is much less drama to do with. So you're telling me you would bless us with your presence with a chubby girl? Man, you are so nice, original poster. You are so nice. You would bless us to be with a chubby girl. Like, you are just so nice. I get what you're trying to say. Like, I'm sure you do have a great job. I'm sure you do look good and stuff. But you don't list anything about your personality because the way I see it is, like, once you hit 45, 50, like, you got to be able to hold your own on the personality scale. You got to be able to make jokes. You got to be able to be a nice person. Like, sure, if you look good when you're 36, sure, you do have good money when you're 36. Sure, it's going to be good. But, like, if you are looking for that forever person, like, you are looking for a long-term relationship, which it sounds like you are, you got to be able to hold your own, like, in, like, personality. Like, you got to be able to hold your own when actually holding a conversation, not talking about, like, just having people in the house that your dad owns because i hate to say it but his great job his hitting the gym and stuff isn't going to help him when he's old and fat by the time he's 60 70 years old so he has to be able to hold his own on his personality scale and all whatever you want to call it but all jokes aside i can tell you that it's not going to be the 5g cell phone towers hormones or anything like that that makes it so like women don't want to be around this guy i can't guarantee you it has to do with him being a narcissist because like he obviously thinks of himself very highly, which I don't blame someone for thinking of yourself very highly. I do think it's good to have pride in yourself. I do think it's good for someone to like think highly of themselves. But, like this guy takes it just a little bit too far, like thinking thinking he's like above American women, thinking he's above other people. Like it's not good to think you're above other person. Like it's good to take pride in yourself, take pride that you have money, take pride that you dress nicely, take pride that you work out. But like it's not good to like think of yourself as being like, better than everyone else i don't know how to explain it better than that but just yeah but thank you for watching if you liked what you saw make sure to subscribe and thank you for watching until next time see you later